In my previous videos, I have already explained that elementary particles can be classified into leptons and hadrons. I have talked a lot of things regarding leptons in my previous videos. You can check out the links in the description box. Talking about hadrons, hadrons are not actually the elementary particles. In 1963, it has been suggested that hadrons do contain two or three kinds of quarks. Quarks are the fundamental constituent of all the hadrons. They are strongly interacting particles. No isolated quarks has been discovered so far. The amazing thing about the quark is that quark has fractional electronic charge. There are altogether six types of quark discovered so far. They are up, down, strange, top, bottom, and charm quark. Now, let's understand about different properties of these quarks. Now, let's talk about the different properties of these quarks. So, I have a table over here. The table for quarks, spin, charge, baryonic number, strangeness, charmness, stopness, and bottomness. These are the properties of the quarks. So I'm going to write here the different types of quark. They are. So let me repeat this again. Up, down, strange, top, bottom, charm. So these are the name of different quarks. Now let's talk about spin. All of the quarks do possess half integral spin because they all are fermions. So we can write all of them has spin 1 by 2. And every anti quarks do also possess half integral spin. Now let's talk about charge. Talking about charge of these quarks, they possess either plus minus e by 3 or plus minus 2e by 3 up quark top quark and charm quark they contains electronic charges plus 2e by 3 and the remaining one contains minus e by 3 to remember this i have a little formula those quarks which uh, possess to give your positive pipes let them put the value plus 2e by 3 like up that up means uh, something that gives you a positive uh, vibes and top that also gives you something like a uh, positive vibes and talking about charms it also gives you a uh, positive vibes so it's a little trick to remember and the remaining one which gives you a negative vibes like down that contains minus e by 3 and strength that also contains minus e by 3 and bottom that also contains minus e by 3 so this is quite easy to remember and every anti quarks do contains the opposite sign like for example anti op contains minus 2e by 3 anti down contains plus e by 3 just the sign will be opposite now let's talk about baryonic number talking about baryonic number every quarks do contains the baryon number 1 by 3 and every anti quark do contains minus 1 by 3. Now let's write about strangeness. Only the strange quark do possess strangeness property. Are all do have strangeness 0. Now writing about strangeness of strange particle that is minus 1 and anti strange quark do have strangeness plus 1. You might get a little confused over here. Let us remember this again. Strangeness property of strange quark do have minus 1 and anti strange quark do have plus 1. Whatever I have been writing here with blue color that represents the anti quarks properties now let's write about charmness only the charm particle do have charmness other all do have zero 
Now the sumness of a charm quark to have value plus one and anti charm to have value minus one. Similarly, for the topness, the top quark to have value plus one and anti top to have value minus one and other all possess zero. Similarly, at the bottom niche, you have the value plus one and anti bottom quark to have the value minus one and remaining all to possess the value zero. So these are the properties of quarks, different kinds of quarks. So let me clear this again. Up quark, down quark, strange quark, top quark, bottom quark, and charm quark. They all do possess the spin, half integral spin. And talking about charms, those names which gives you the positive vibes, they have, do have positive the charge plus 2e by 3, plus 2e by 3, and plus 2e by 3, and other contents minus e by 3. And their anti particles do possess the different signs, opposite signs from them. Talking about baryonic number, all of the quark do have baryon number 1 by 3 and anti quark do have the baryon number minus 1 by 3. Talking about strangeness, charmness, topness, and bottomness, all of them represent their respective quarks and anti quarks. So, this was for today. Don't forget to like and share among your friends, and also don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you will never miss my video ever again. Okay? Yeah.